During the pandemic, those little plastic cassettes to test for COVID were produced and used by the millions and then tossed out. A byproduct of the world's response to COVID was a mountain of lateral flow tests, LFTs, made of virgin plastics from fossil fuels. But a Scottish researcher is reprocessing some novel ingredients to make a new generation of LFTs. We've made one in recycled chewing gum. In case you missed that, she said chewing gum. Old chewing gum, um, uh, fridge parts and uh, limestones. So chewing gum mostly scraped off the street along with discarded parts from refrigerators and other bioproducts that can replace virgin plastics with something less harmful to the environment. What we're hoping is that uh, through uh, the use of these cassettes, we can ultimately uh, save 30 to 50 percent of the carbon footprint uh, of the virgin material production. Really, this is the challenge of modern healthcare. This professor of anthropology and health says many medical devices are not only produced with fossil fuels, they end up in the oceans and soil. We are producing huge numbers of single use plastic devices, but those same devices are also contributing to a growing burden of plastic pollution globally. Some two to four billion lateral flow tests are produced globally each year, not just for COVID, but for pregnancy and infectious diseases. The challenge is scaling up these prototypes into an industry of recyclables. We have the machinery, the skill sets, and all the knowledge that we need to be able to turn this into a mass-produced item, move into a more sustainable option on products like this. The message to the medical industry? Heal thyself. We need not only healthcare systems that will contribute to growth and to health, we also need healthcare systems that are themselves healthy. And we may soon have old chewing gum to thank for products that make us healthy while not making the environment unhealthy. Eric Sorensen, Global News, Toronto.